welcome to this excellent game. And by excellent, I mean... It's Moderately mi it, excellent. It's a misunderstood game. This is Jurassic Park for the Genesis. One of my childhood favorite games. Uh, really? Yes, I played this game a lot as a child, but... I'd, I'd always watch my sister play this game, because we had a Genesis. Run, run, run like a bun. <laughs> no, that wasn't that one. But this game scared the shit out of me as a kid, especially this right here. Like, look at his eyes in the mirror. Uh -huh. That that scared me so much. It gave me nightmares. <laughs> so anyways. And the unit was also one of my favorite games. Well, I loved it. Well, when I got a little bit older, I started playing it myself. The Rex has demolished your car. The electric fences are down. The Rex. Right. And all the dinosaurs are loose on the island. Make your way through the jungle to the power station. Reminds me of um, how we ca how we called them um, Victi from Streets of Rage 3. We kept calling him the Roo. The Roo. Yeah, the Roo. Instead of the kangaroo, it's just the Roo. The Roo. This game really has good graphics. Like, I don't care what anyone says. It's supposed to be dark and gloomy, and they actually pull off that really well. Mm -hmm. Like, it's a nice parallax they got going on there. But anyways, I feel like I have a defective copy of this game somehow because the game, like, lags sometimes. I'm not sure uh -huh. if it's actually supposed to do that, but mm -hmm. what? But whatever. It's not It's not so bad in this first level, but in the later levels it gets kind of rough, which you'll see. So anyways, are, you, are you shooting bullets or darts? Those are tranquilizer darts. Alright, so it makes sense why they're elongated. Yeah. Do you take fall damage? Yes. In fact, this game... If you fall too far, you'll literally just fall through all the scenery and you'll die. It's kind of funny. You'll definitely see it. He'll just go, ah, when he dies. Are there limited continues? There are three lives and no continues. But there, well. is, a, but there is a password feature. Okay. So that's like the one saving grace is that you can, and it gives you the password automatically. Uh -huh. So like you just go to the password screen and wherever you last were, it'll automatically give you that password so it's pretty good. You look pretty good. I knew you were going to do that. So, this part, like, this game is definitely built in a very interesting way. It's not uh, a <laughs> traditional platformer by any means. <laughs> like, you'll see. Are we, we going to see that? That thing? Yeah. What thing? The, the thing that comes out of the water. This thing? <laughs> you wait till you see what I have to do with him later. You have to like ride him. Yeah. Um. All right. That's the first level. Okay. First of all, there are no checkpoints in the level, so if you die in the level, you have to start the very beginning of that level every time. Huh. You, you carry your you carry your life bars over from level to level, so that's a little frustrating. But the game, uh, the style of the game. Is just, just really fascinates me. It's very dark and gloomy. Same with the music. The music is very dark and ambient. Like mm -hmm. this. This is one of my favorite songs from the game right here. The power plant. Um, you can't really hear it because we yeah. have the volume too low. Uh, this game is also interesting because you can play the game as, you can play it as either Grant, Doctor Grant from the movie, mm -hmm. or you can also play it as the Velociraptor. I'm not going to deal with that. If you, <laughs> if, if you get shocked with those things, that thing also scared me so much as a does child. Does it show the skeleton? Yes, of uh. course it does. But it would freak me out. I remember crying to my mom one night because I was thinking about it. <laughs> but I was only five at the time. I'm trying to think of something that would have scared me like that. I need the barrel. I need the, the, the box to go down the elevator with me. It's like... You're actually looking at, you can actually look way further into the level, like right here. I'm looking to the right, that's mm. that's further on the level. So I see the, the the entire level is all on one giant map. Like, mm -hmm. there are a lot of games that do that, but I don't know, the levels just seem really big for some reason. Mm -hmm. That and the, the, the music, not, not the music, the voice samples are really good in this game. So... Are the electric shocks instant kill? No, they aren't, but okay. they zap you and you'll fall. 
Oh, you, that old chestnut. It's just like, oh yeah, I spent some... like three hours climbing up this thing. Up, oh, I got hit by an enemy, now I gotta do it all over again. Yeah, I know. Wario <laughs> Land 3 has too much of that. Except this, there's actually a pattern, so... Why is something scary? What? Oh, it's a Velociraptor! Uh, is it instant kill? <laughs> no. But th my sister would always screw with me and like wait here for the Velociraptor to come down. Mm -hmm. Like, there's a spot coming up later in the level. It would. Oh my god, it would scare me so much. Alright. This is like a scene change right here. They never do this in this game. The music changes. Like, that thing would scare me too. So, those are compies, like the really small dinosaurs. They'll jump at your face and just bite your frickin' face off. Ugh! <laughs> it scared me. Let's see, um... When I was little, I remember being scared of that. Uh, like, you know see that? that. <laughs> God! <laughs> like, this would scare me too, like he's trying to jump at me, huh? Oh, oh, oh he's, I hate he's that shit, where you have to like... Where you have to like... <laughs> oh, look at that! The, the animation in this game is so good. Was this developed by Sega? No, th uh, is it this is Blue Sky. Blue, Blue Sky? Yes. Any relation to the, the studio that produced such films as Ice oh, Age and, and Robots? Like, yeah. Uh, I've thought about that, but I've never looked into it. But they also, this company also made Vector Man. Yeah, um, like because they, their logo is the same. Yeah, they, they even reused some of the same sound effects. You're right for the most amazing thing ever. Watch this, watch this. Yo. Got him. No, she would do this. She'd, because the dinosaur will get up and chase you. She'd like wait right here. I'd be like, oh my god, go, go! I'd like be screaming at the TV because <laughs> I'd be so scared. Because you can you can hear his his, um, his thud, the noise yeah. he makes when he jumps, and because he's trying to like he's getting closer to you. It's kind of like how the SAX and Metroid Fusion has that echoey footstep. Watch this. <laughs> oh my. <laughs> Look at that. Look right here. You have to hit this button that's very... That... He'll eat you. It's so scary when he eats you. Let him eat you. No, because I'll have to start the whole level over. Oh, that's right. Well, you'd be funny though, Ethy. I have to throw a flash grenade at him. Just be careful. Another one. Hurry up. And bam. I'm kind of good at this game. How far are we in the recording anyway? Um... Seven minutes. Alright, let's keep going. Okay. You will find a rubber raft outside by the river. It is low on fuel, and all the fuel cans are scattered downstream. <laughs> this level... You knew this is that where the, chestnut. This is where the game gets hard. Mm. For some reason, this reminds very, me of Very, very trial and error. This reminds me of that part in Uncharted 1, where you were, like, on the jet ski, and you had to, like, navigate up through the temples. Yeah. The music in this level is also really good. Mm. And, like, I wish I could hear it, but... You can hear the dinosaurs roaring at you. Yeah, the I voice samples do sound decent. I'll give it that. I'll give it that. Like, right here. I, I have to let go of the controller. Now I have to turn right as soon as I can. Because if I fall over that other waterfall, uh, I'll die. Like I said, this this level... And no part, checkpoints? No checkpoints. You start the whole entire level uh, over. How long would you say the levels go on, on average? Only a few minutes. Okay. They That's get a little longer. Uh, I don't know. There are only seven levels. So there's not going to be like a level that's like ten minutes long, and then like it has like a Kaizo trap at the end that you can't avoid. There is one level that is that is broken. I don't care what anyone says, but literally, if we get stuck on that level, I'm just going to put in the password for the last level. Okay. Because the sixth level of this game is absolutely broken. Mm -hmm. See, I would have died there too. Uh, how far can you usually get before you get a game over? Have you ever beaten uh, the game? Yeah, I can beat the game. Okay. Usually I just skip the sixth level because it's stupid. I don't think I was supposed to do that. Mm-hmm. Wait. No, I'm dead. Whoops. That was a total accident. Oh, you can't jump down? I can jump down, I forgot. Okay. <laughs> I, for I forgot I could jump down. That scared I've me. I've beaten this game many times, Michael. Well, oh I've no, I'm screwed! <laughs> I've, never, I've never done that. I don't know why, but the T-Rex sprite just looks so goofy. It's only his head. It's just like, uh, well, do, do you see? Uh, Look at this one. He's waiting for us. And then... Whoa, what the, what the fuck? <laughs> Isn't that cute? Yeah. 
Here it is. Okay. Right there. If I if I fall down there, I die. Okay. Why are there multiple rafts? Because what kind of raft needs fuel? Uh, yeah, I don't think that was supposed to happen, but whatever. I'll be fine. Oh, it was supposed to happen. If it falls over too far, do you like fall in the water and die? No, you don't. <laughs> Wait. Right at the end of this level, there's a bullshit thing. I'm waiting for the other pterodactyl. <laughs> I have to hurry up. Okay. Bum, 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 bum. Is there a meter for your fuel? No, you just start running out. The, the boat will, like stutter. Right there, if you jump up there, he'll he'll knock you off and he'll drown. Okay, I got him. Mm. And there we go, third level done. Uh, join us next time when we'll take on my favorite level, uh, my second favorite level of the game. It is my second and a half favorite level of the game. Yes, thank you very much. The and pump station. Remember it. The pump station, huh?